One Shot Keto is an exogenous ketone supplement touted to give you explosive energy and in the process put you in ketosis, help you burn fat for fuel, and do all this without causing any fatigue. Sounds great. So in this review, let's look at the ingredients in One Shot Keto and the research and give you some tips if you decide to try One Shot Keto for yourself. So right off the bat, realize that there is no clinical research on One Shot Keto itself. Rather, the research is on its key ingredient. As for what the ingredients in One Shot Keto are, well, the company tells us that the main ingredient is BHB, beta-hydroxybutyrate, which is a ketone. And as you can see here, the company lists four different types of BHB ketones. There's calcium BHB, magnesium BHB ketones, potassium BHB ketones, and sodium BHB ketones as well. And while we're on the topic, I would say don't worry about the minerals, calcium, magnesium, potassium, and sodium. The minerals are used to enhance the absorption of beta-hydroxybutyrate ketones. They play no role in putting you in ketosis, rather they just help you absorb the BHB better. While we make ketones in small amounts in the body all the time, since you're taking one-shot keto as a supplement, this means it's an example of an exogenous ketone supplement. Exogenous means the ketones arise from outside of the body. BHB ketones are also found in other exogenous ketone supplements, which tells us that it's pretty popular, and fortunately, there is some research on BHB too. So what is the weight loss proof for BHB ketones? So we have this investigation where 15 people consumed a BHB ketone drink, and before we go on, I'll say that the amount of BHB they consumed was based on how much they weighed, in other words, the more they weighed, the more BHB ketones they consumed. But regardless, what happened? Well, the beta-hydroxybutyrate drink raised their ketone levels in the blood, and it also appeared to suppress their hunger and their desire to eat. And the researchers also reported that BHB ketones reduced hormones involved with hunger, such as insulin, ghrelin, and GLP-1. Now, that's all really interesting, but keep in mind that suppressing appetite and hunger doesn't necessarily mean BHB ketones, beta-hydroxybutyrate, will help people lose weight. What we really need are studies that specifically look at BHB ketones and weight loss, such as this investigation here, where 24 people both younger and older people, drank one ounce of a ketone drink three times a day for one month. It was noted that BHB ketones were not effective at reducing body weight, but that's just a month. It may take longer than one month to see weight loss. So what would happen if, say, you took BHB ketones for two months? For two months, people in this investigation were put on a low-calorie ketogenic diet, and some of those people also supplemented with BHB ketones in addition to eating fewer calories. These researchers reported that it didn't matter if the people consumed BHB ketones or not. Eating fewer calories was what was most important for weight loss. And here is an even longer investigation involving adolescents who took a whopping 7,500 milligrams of BHB ketones or placebo each day for three months. Here it was reported that the BHB ketones were safe in the adolescents, and that's good to know, but what about weight loss? Remember, this investigation lasted three whole months, which is more than enough time to see if beta-hydroxybutyrate helped these kids lose weight. So did it. No. Even though beta-hydroxybutyrate significantly raised BHB ketone levels in the blood, they had no significant effect on weight loss. Take a look at the before and after body weight and percent body fat in these adolescents. As you can see, they're reporting the before and after in terms of kilograms, so in the beginning, they weigh about 52, 53 kilograms, which is roughly about 114 pounds. And then again, after three months, you don't see much of a difference. Same thing with the placebo. Before and after body weight is about the same thing. And then if we look at the percent body fat, 
Again, you're not seeing a big difference in the body fat percentage of those taking the ketone drink and those taking the placebo. And if you notice these P values highlighted in yellow, it just means from a clinical standpoint, the results were not significantly different than each other. So if you're curious who makes one shot keto, the first clue is to look at the return address, 9454 Wilshire Boulevard, Beverly Hills, California. If you put that address into a search engine, you'll find that it's the same address as a company called Limitless. The website is limitlesssx.com. This website appears to be some sort of an online advertising company that represents other brands such as Divitrim and Amaros and several other products. But we're not done yet because another company that appears to be involved with One Shot Keto is called Emblaze One. So is this the company behind One Shot Keto? I stopped looking at this point, but if you're interested in going down this rabbit hole for yourself, I hope this saves you some time. If you're going to try One Shot Keto for yourself, I would say do your research. The supplement may be sold under different brands, and the different brands may have different ingredients. For example, here's a One Shot Keto supplement sold by Total Vitamins. If we take a look at the supplement facts label, we see that two capsules of this brand contains 800 milligrams of calcium BHB, magnesium BHB, and sodium BHB as well. However, if we look at another brand, such as this One Shot Keto sold by a company called Organic Source, we see that three capsules provides other ingredients in addition to BHB ketones. Here we also see medium chain triglycerides, Garcinia cambogia, apple cider vinegar, and green tea. And here is another One Shot Keto supplement put out by a company called Justified Labs. If we look at the supplement facts label here, we see that two capsules has not only magnesium, calcium, and sodium beta-hydroxybutyrate, but also apple cider vinegar, green tea, and macadamia nut oil. Here's the thing, the other ingredients you see in these other ketone supplements, well, they have nothing to do with ketosis. So why are some companies adding them in? I'll leave that to you to decide. As for my opinions and conclusions, so far, most clinical investigations of BHB exogenous ketone supplements show it doesn't promote any weight loss that's significant. And if you're going to try one shot keto for yourself, be sure to look at the supplement facts label to make sure you're getting BHB ketones. And don't worry so much about any of the other ingredients because I'm personally not convinced they add anything to the effects of the supplement. And lastly, remember that the ketogenic diet is not the same thing as exogenous ketone supplements. Ketogenic diets promote fast weight loss, at least in the short term, because they cause you to lose water weight. The elevation in ketones caused by the ketogenic diet are not the main driver of weight loss. And as you can see from the studies I presented here, simply elevating blood ketone levels by taking a ketone supplement isn't promoting any weight loss. Have you tried One Shot Keto or other exogenous ketone supplements? Leave a comment below and let me know what happened. Until next time, I'm Joe from SupplementClarity.com. Take care.